Magandang buhay mga bata! I am Teacher Maricar F. Nickdow of Angeles Elementary School. Today, you will learn a new lesson in mathematics. Our lesson is all about visualizing multiplication of numbers 1 to 10 by 6, 7, 8, and 9. You will learn how to visualize multiplication of numbers 1 to 10 by 6, 7, 8, and 9. Let's start our discussion with a story problem. In the celebration of Buwan ng Wika, seven girls enter the room dancing to the tune of Pahay Kubo. Each girl is carrying a bilao filled with eight eggplants. What are the girls carrying? They are carrying a bilao. How many bilaos are there? There are seven bilaos. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven. How many eggplants are there in each bilao? There are eight eggplants in each bilao. How many eggplants are there in all? Very good. There are 56 eggplants in all. An easier way and faster way to count all the eggplants is through the use of multiplication. To do this, we simply multiply the number of groups to the number of objects per group to get the product. Product is the answer in a multiplication sentence or equation. There are seven bilaos, therefore there are seven groups. Each bilao has eight eggplants. If we multiply seven and eight, we will have a product of 56. We can read it as seven groups of eight. Multiplication tables for six, seven, eight, and nine are usually more challenging than of two, three, Four and five. You should have mastered the multiplication tables for two, three, four, and five before moving on to six, seven, and eight. Let's try to skip count by six. Six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, thirty, thirty-six, forty-two, forty-eight, fifty-four, sixty. Let's now move to 7. 7, 14, 21, 28, 35, 42, 49, 56, 63, 70. Let's keep count number 8. 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64, 72, 80. Lastly, let's skip count by 9. 9, 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, 72, 81, 90. Let's try more examples. There are six groups of five drums on the picture. If we multiply six and five, how many drums are there in all? Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. There are 30 drums in all. 
Let's try another one. There are seven groups of ten flutes. How many flutes are there in all? Very good. There are seventy flutes. There are eight groups of four guitars in each group. How many guitars are there in all? Very good. There are 32 guitars. We can also use tables to show and visualize multiplication equation. We just need to count the number of squares per column and per row. There are 8 columns multiplied by 6 rows. What would be our product? If we count all the number of squares, our product is 48. Let us try another one. Let's count the number of columns. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Next, let's try to count the number of rows. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. There are 7 rows. If we multiply 9 and 7, what would be our product? Very good. The product is 63. If there are 6 columns and 9 rows, what would be our product? Our product is 54. If we have 7 columns multiplied by 3 rows, what would be our product? Our product is 21. We can also use sticks to visualize multiplication. There are 7 groups of 4 sticks. If we count all the number of sticks, we can get our product. Let's try to skip count by 4. 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28. Our product is 28. Let's try to multiply 6 by 6. Let's try to skip count 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36. There are 36 sticks. Let's try 10 multiplied by 8. There are 10 groups of 8 sticks. 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64, 72, 80. There are 80 sticks in all. Can you help me answer the following problems? There are 9 trays with 6 chicos in each tray. How many chicos are there in all the tray? Very good. If we multiply 9 and 6, our product is 54. There are 54 chicos in all the trays. Noel places his marble in 7 small boxes. Each box has 8 marbles. How many marbles are there all together? Let us multiply 7 by 8. 
If we multiply 7 and 8, our product is 56. There are 56 marbles all together. My mother bought 7 boxes of donut with 6 donuts in each box. How many donuts are there in all? Let us multiply 7 by 6. The product of 7 and 6 is 42. There are 42 donuts in all. Thank you for watching kids. I hope you learned something from this discussion. Again, magandang buhay!